Welcome back to Pilots Watching Pilots, the show where we watch pilots of your favorite TV shows. Mike, what do you got? Today we watched Chappelle Show from January 22nd, 2003. It's not HBO, it's regular ass TV. Chappelle Show was a cultural phenomenon. This show took every college kid at home and said, hey, I'm Rick James, bitch. This was such a large, like, wow, graphic but mainstream show that really did change culture. Some would say for the worse, but some would say for the better. We're gonna debate that in this episode. So uh, let's skip that part and Ryan, let's get into it and break this down. So the show starts as a car commercial. Mm -hmm. He says Mitsubishi. It's actually a Nissan ZX100. I don't know anything about cars. You knew the car because you're like a car guy. I'm a, I'm a car guy. Yeah, I'm not a car. Um, super funny. Uh, next scene. Well, that he, was a good bit. That was a good funny bit. And then they show a bit after that where he goes into the variety show. And he shows um, a blooper of that show, and he has a blooper describing a blooper. Titties. Which is like, now that's a titty. Fun, and then he shows the girl's titty that pops out. So that's fun. This is like trying to be a variety show meets a stand-up show meets a sketch show, which was cool. I like that part. I like that you go back to him, and he's talking to you about the sketches that they just did. Lastly, we have Clayton Bigsby. Wow, this sketch was insane. Bonkers. Yeah. I don't know how you, you do this. I don't know how you write it. I don't know how you agree to produce it. Every part of it was nuts. This was just so crazy. In the all-time Chappelle show skits, this is in everyone's top three, top five, easily. What, you don't think I can write them books? Just because I'm blind don't mean I'm dumb. This was not trying to be SNL. They're, they're not trying to be the whitest kids you know and, and all these other ones. They're trying to be a show that's different and tell you a message. And that's what Dave Chappelle was trying to do. This was a, a clear message to you as to wake the fuck up. This show is serious as much as it's hilarious. And that sketch was insane. I, I, I enjoyed it, but also, it's nuts, it's crazy. It makes you feel uncomfortable while you're laughing hysterically, mm -hmm. which a lot of the show is trying to do. So, we brought you to this downward moment. We're bringing it back up, don't worry. We'll get back upstairs, but we need another drink. I'm almost done with this Moscow Mule. Ryan, what are you drinking, Bush Light let's or finish, let's Bush Light? Let's finish these, and let's uh, call that old flight attendant. All right, Ryan, what are we doing today? <clears throat> Looks like we're doing 99 root beers. All right. Well, let's get after it. These 99s usually kill you. Not these. This is root beer. This root beer. Everyone loves root beer. There's, what, 39 flavors of different roots in here? 99. Oh, I knew that part would come. I knew that last part would come. All right, so let's talk a little bit about this show. <coughs> um, some of the history of it that I think is pretty important to talk about. Dave Chappelle's original company is called Pilot Boy Productions. Pilot Boys, are you kidding me? That's fantastic. He um, came up with that idea and then they proceeded to make a ton of, Dave Chappelle went on a ton of TV show pilots. He kept making them every year. From as early as like 92 or 93, he was making <coughs> pilots. None of them got picked up until finally the Chappelle show. He kept making pilots. That's wrong. My butt is itching like crazy and I took a shower. Can I help you? All right, final thoughts, Ryan. What did you think of this episode? Honestly, it wasn't awful, it wasn't bad, it wasn't great either. Um, I thought the sketches were pretty funny. Um, I mean, it, it's a pilot, so I get it. But uh, that last one, whew, borderline. With their kung fu and all that silly chang chang chong talk, I can't understand you. Go back to your country, white pop. 
there's so much in his speaking and his speak speech, I guess, which I think it, right now is so important in this world. He literally yells, send her back at one point, which is like, wow, is this guy Trump or a KKK member? I don't know, but it was it was impressive. And it was crazy. The, sh the show overall is a genius show. You have to watch it. I couldn't recommend it anymore. Ryan, it's time for you though to land on this bird. Thanks for watching. Be sure you like and subscribe. Mike, what do you got? Follow us on social media, but also when you go back, watch our videos, find out exactly every time we say, this was a feel good pilot. Anytime we say feel good, drink, because this is also a drinking game. Ryan, hit that button. Let's go down to the cargo deck. Um, flight attendant. Ryan.